Hey, what's up everybody? I'm here to show you guys how to get rid of this huge problem that's been happening lately with the FBI money pack virus. The first thing you need to do to uh, get this process going is to restart your computer. Once it turns off uh, and comes back on, you want to keep hitting the F8 button. Uh, you want to keep hitting it until it comes to a black screen. You want to choose safe mode with networking. Now, the first step, once you get into your desktop, you want to come down here to your start, and you want to click all programs. Now, if you check from here on down, there should be a file called CTF. Um, I obviously don't have it anymore. I got rid of the virus. So you'll find it somewhere in here with an icon that looks like a microphone. Find that and delete it. Uh, next we want to bring up your CDM command screen. You want to go down your start, type CMD. Now you get into this screen. Now you want to start off by typing CD front slash enter and then you type in del period space s backslash space ctf mon dot lnk now it's not going to do anything for me um, Actually, guys, you want to have a DEL period space S backslash CTFMON dot LNK. Now, that's the right command. Now, whenever you click it, obviously it doesn't do anything for me since I don't have it anymore. But it will come up and it will ask if it wants to, if you want to delete um, a bunch of files. Um, you keep saying yes, put Y for all of them. Um, there should be maybe around 8, 10, maybe even more than that. Keep doing it until it says it starts saying access denied. That's when all the files that are able to be deleted are gone. This step is finished. Uh, next, we want to go to your temporary Internet files. The easiest way to do this is go to your start and... Now, don't type temporary files because it won't show up. What you want to do is you want to put percent temp, see how it still doesn't come up, and then put another percent sign, and you'll see your temp. Go to your temp file. See all these files, everything in here from top to bottom. Go ahead and delete everything. Now, there's going to be some files that you can't delete, which is okay because... Uh, they're in use but uh, delete everything in this folder uh, because you'll never know exactly what vi what the virus disguised itself as uh, you'll never know the name of it don't worry you won't lose any important files or saved passwords or anything like that these are basically useless temporary files that will be automatically deleted anyway in the future um, once you've done that go to your recycle bin and make sure everything is deleted in here. Now that step's finished. Next you want to go to uh, Internet Explorer. Now go up here. And since you're in safe mode with networking, um, you can access the Internet. So type in www.fixpcyourself.com backslash rkill.com. It will ask you if you want to run or save. Click save. And then click run. This, uh, it, it'll start... A, um, a black command screen. You don't have to do anything. Just let it sit and finish.
what this does is it pretty much stops all of the running processes of any of the viruses that might be on your PC. So once this comes up, you really don't have to do anything. Just let it keep going. Um, it's preparing now. It takes about 30 seconds. Okay, once it's finished, you'll get a screen like this. That's when you know it's done. You can close this out. Now, next thing you want to do, go back to your Internet Explorer. Uh, processes are stopped. Uh, you want to go back up to your address bar. You want to type in www.fixpcyourself.com backslash mbam.exe. Just like this. Click it. It'll take you to the screen. Now, if you don't already have malware bytes, um, it's pretty essential that you have it. I have Norton, and uh, I guess most times I'll run a full scan in Norton, uh, with showing no problems. But then I run a scan with malware bytes, and it finds numerous threats. So, uh, and this is one of the best uh, antiviruses out there. Um, it's a pretty ideal program to use. What you want to do is you want to run a scan. You want to run the malware byte scan, um, and upon finish, do a full scan. And upon finish, you should have about two infected files dealing with the FBI scam. Uh, what el whatever else that you find there is uh, probably the rest of the previous infections on on your PC. Um, and after that, finally, go to the Start menu once again and type system restore uh, basically go here and you want to basically pick any date um, before your computer was infected I usually pick one week uh, to five days before um, that would be fine you know how this goes so that's pretty much it guys uh, that's the uh, steps from beginning to end, and I hope I help you guys out. If it doesn't work, um, comment your problem, and I'll try to find a solution for it.